Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and delighted to be joined as always by Stuart Robson. And what we have for you tonight is live Champions League group stage match day one action. It's Panathinaikos up against Inter. Yes, cheers Derek. Well, what an occasion it is for this club and its supporters. These are the games that they dream of. No doubting they're the underdogs. If they can frustrate their opponents, stay in the game up until half-time, you just never know. Hope rate cup tight and maybe even a massive surprise. Well, it's a 4-3-3 formation with a centre forward and two wingers. So it's important that the midfield players give support to the striker whenever the ball goes wide. They can't allow him to be isolated. The Inter starting lineup. Alessandro Bastoni plays with Francesco Acerbi in central defence. Hakan Chalanolu plays alongside Nicolo Barella in the centre of midfield. And in attack, Romelu Lukaku starts alongside Lautaro Martinez. It's the opening match day. Champions League group stage A1 underway. Martinez, determined defending. And the referee is quite rightly letting it go. Top class defending. Good work to regain possession. Well, I think just lost his focus for a second and a throw-in conceded. Brozovic. And unable to keep possession. Chalanolu. Lukaku. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. Can he get them in front? He had to react and did. And the pass, a good one. Good technique displayed. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Inter exploiting the space on the flank. Martinez. Now Brozovic. Can he find the net? And a goal! Now they have their opener, and now they can celebrate. Well, we won't get tired of watching this because the interplay around the box is wonderful. And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike.
Underway once again with Inter in front. Lukaku. Bad pass. Palacios. Ruben Perez. Bernard. A good and fair challenge. Barella. And return to Bernard. It's an opportunity. Bernard. Ruben Perez. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Lukaku. Brozovic. Romelu Lukaku now. And the danger is averted. Barella. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Good vision. Can he get on to this? Well, he had a decent reading of that ball in. Can he put it away? And a decent save, full credit. Well, just listen to the fans. They know this is a big chance here. <laughs> Trying to pick out a teammate. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half-time here. You certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the play. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. That's what you call defending from the front possibilities here. Borar. Bernard with it. This is looking threatening. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Martinez. Romelu Lukaku now. Really good interception. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Well, that break looked so promising, but nothing coming from it. Brozovic. Return to Lukaku. But well, I'll tell you what, that didn't miss by much. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Car Mancini and space to attack and a good challenge to bring that attack to an end and that came off the defender so it'll be a corner 
Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Short corner it is. Could be troublesome. Looking for that final pass and for that chance to level the game. Good effort here! Well, I must admit it didn't trouble the keeper to the extent that I thought it might. Barella. Well, they've won possession back. What can they do from here? Sebastian Palacios takes the shot and a fine stop. And now the delivery. Well, not cleared away completely. He takes aim. And the keeper there to deal with it. Playing it in, struggling to get it away, closing down well, and turned onto the woodwork. Well, defenders having to cover up. That's well blocked. Well, they're creating chances. They now just need to take one of them. Mind you, what a save that was. Well, rule two have taken up an illegal position only just. And they're making a change. Ten minutes to go. They've got to be really mindful of the time situation, attacking though they might be. Firing it in. It looked as though it had a chance of going in for the equaliser. It was close, it was a decent effort, just need to keep plugging away now and surely the goal will come. Oh, he saved it well. They decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Played over. No real challenge for the goalkeeper. They are making headway, but really they need a goal with time not on their side. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have three extra minutes. Will he play it in? And a poor ball. And there goes the final whistle. Well, they've got to make up for lost time now. A defeat at home on match day one, Stuart. Yeah, they'll be disappointed. It's an uphill battle if you don't get anything from your opening game. It really comes down to how they bounce back now. Vital we see a better performance next time out.
Well, we're focusing on him for a reason. Played with real authority in attack, Stuart. Well, he obviously scored the winning goal, but it was his overall performance that impressed me most. He was on fire today, 